some way, Kaveri uh, calling. Don't think of Kaveri calling as a project. Kaveri is calling. In some way has it touched your heart? Huh? Because this cry is not just of the river, of every life that thrives on this river. And the easiest places to revive is always a river basin, because the river basin is full of life, it is waiting to come back, if only if you give a little support. So we have chosen a river basin because that is the easiest place to work. Kaveri Basin has 5.2 million farmers, 83,000 square kilometers. One of the richest lands in the world for centuries. But today, you go and look at the farmer's condition, you will be meeting them, many of them. It's not desirable kind of place to be. And you ask how many farmers want their children to get into farming, you will be shocked. Nobody wants, hardly two percent maybe. So, our food security for this nation is both in terms of nobody wanting to take up farming and also soil not being ready to generate anything for us. Both ways there is the serious risk. Above all, it is our humanity that should go to work. If we doing work, we are running an industry, we are running this and that, we are running movements, we are running stock markets. All this is meaningful only if we are in touch with our humanity. Otherwise, the same things that we think are useful, the same things that we think are great work, will turn into disasters over a period of time and that's what you're seeing right now. We thought clearing forests and farming and farming and farming endlessly is progress. That progress is bringing us to a brink of a disaster. When I talk about food scarcity, that may happen, hope it doesn't, that may happen in 19... I mean 2040, how many years is it away from you? Just nineteen, twenty years is what we're talking about. So it is not even future generations, it's going to be in this generation. All the volunteers, the thirty teams of volunteers, they are going to go every day from panchayat to panchayat and cover 1,785 panchayats in 57 taluks in nine districts. And in every event, they will be meeting the elected panchayat members and the farmers and the representatives, the officers and staff of Forest Department, Horticulture Department, Sericulture Department and Panchayati Raj Department. These are the departments which are already involved with the farmers. They are helping the farmers. There are various government schemes which exist to help the farmers to plant trees. I got introduced to Kaveri Calling and Kaveri has been very close to my heart because my childhood, most of my holidays were in Kaveri, uh, a village nearby Kaveri Basin. Yeah, this is my first time, uh, you know, I am uh, going to the rural India and I just, uh, my, my, basically my point is ki, uh, you know, we talk uh, all these things on social media but uh, we need to actually go uh, on the field and uh, see for ourselves, you know, what is the condition of the river, what is the condition of the farmers, how is the soil, you know, how are they living, you know, we can't just sit here in a city and, you know, talk big things. So, we need to go there and, you know, actually see and work. Either we are going to be a part of the world, we are going to be a part of the world, we are going to be a part of the world, we are going to be a part of the world, we are going to be a part of the world. Kaveri Kuhu and Nobiana Dali, Baga Vaisalu, and Anatumba Utsuka Hago, um, Tumbane, blessed Anta Baustin. Thank you. So, we have appointed some 890 Maramitra, they are the friends of the trees. You also want to become Maramitra? Mannamitra, you must become a.